we want to look at the word gospel and, and find out the origin and the meaning of the word that is used to describe those first four books of the New Testament, um, the Gospels of Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. So the word gospel is actually coming from the, the Old English word God spell. Um, God actually referring to not uh, God, but, but good. And, and spell talking about a a news or good tidings is often one way of, of, of translating it. So the Old English word is coming actually from the, the original Greek, which has a similar meaning. Um, the word angelion is, is the Greek word for gospel or good news or good message. If you break apart the two parts of the Greek word, eu or eu means good and Angelion means message. And you'll probably notice that the word angelion has the word angel in it. And angels were actually messengers from God. And, and that's where the word angel comes from. That gospels are the good message or the good news or the good story uh, of Jesus Christ. And this is where we get the words evangelist. So we call the, the writers of the first four gospels um, the evangelists. So St. John the evangelist, um, St. Luke the evangelist, Matthew, Mark, are, are both evangelists. And we also have the word evangelism that we often hear today that refers to the people who are preaching the good news or preaching the gospel, spreading the word of God um, around the world. So this is a term that St. Paul used. It wasn't just a title of a genre or of books, but it was actually referring to a message that was alive and able to transform the, the lives of the people who heard it. So when we hear the word gospel, it's not just a, a title of a type of book um, or a genre. It's actually something that, that is a message that is alive and well, um, transforming our hearts.